Hi, my Cancer friends, cross watchers. Welcome to your reading. Welcome to my world. If I haven't met you, my name is Cleopatra. That's Misko, Raven on the floor. Roscoe sleeping right here. Anyway, it's part of my tribe. Um, welcome, and um, I'm doing your weekly reading or something, well, um, event reading of this week. Um, today is November 19th, Monday. Let's see what we got in store here for my cancers. Okay, Let me shut some of these guys up. Now we're going to base this reading off of my moon oracle cards. Let's see what messages we have to relate with. And it better not be boundaries, because I had that twice, back to back. Well, it better not, not be, but isn't that, that would be pretty amazing. And it's not, it's darkness. Okay, darkness. You know, sometimes we all need to be in the darkness. We need to be in that dark to think, to concentrate some alone time. I'm not saying that that's what it is, but that's something I'm feeling here right now. Let's see what the cards say. I think of that as a solace, like um, a soul darkness, like a spiritual, um, a spiritual rest, um, an energy that needs to be restored is what I'm feeling with that card. My Cancer friends. Cancers are tough lovers. They love a lot. Ooh, look what we pull right away. Hmm. With the Two of Swords, Cancers, I think that um, you have a lot going on in your brain right now and you need to make a decision. You feel um, balanced. You feel really balanced, though. Right? But it's a, a big decision that needs to be made. Okay, a big decision that needs to be made for this week. Unless it's happened. Huh. I'm feeling that this decision... Oops, we had two pop out. Let's see how they come up. Mm -hmm. Oh my. We have two that fell on the floor that are the major arcana cards, um, a major decision to make, and, you need, and I'm already seeing what sensing what this is. This um, is a relationship that needs to come to an end. Don't know what kind of relationship. I don't know. Could, for some of you, it could be um, a family relationship, um, a brother, sister. Um, someone that you're very close with, very a very strong connection. This is a strong connection. This is not, not just for lovers, but this is for loved ones also. Um, hmm. So we have a relationship that needs to come to an end. Is that what the decision is? Mm-hmm. Okay, Cancers. I know. Oh, I need my battery. Sorry about that. My battery just informed me that it was low. Oh, my Cancers, they love hard. They are good people. They are true nurturers. And they're highly intuitive. So I know that you Cancers, um, you are very intuitive. And I know that you get feelings. And I... I can tell you right now, you need to follow your heart on this decision. It's usually your head or your heart. Um, this one I'm going to tell you to follow your heart on, okay? This major decision. Hmm. It's going to bring you some peace. I'm telling you, with this darkness card... This is, you're going to have some peace in your life. Don't be scared. 
Okay, make decisions out of love and not fear. Remember that. Always remember that. Make decisions out of love and not fear. And I just told you, this decision that you have to make, you have to use your head and your heart. And I recommended your heart on this one. Okay? I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Look at that. Another major card. This is a good card. This is progress, right? The chariot, he's determined, um, and he's making progress. So um, with that, I know you guys and girls, <laughs> you guys are gonna, um, you're gonna do, you're gonna do the right thing. I have very strong faith you're gonna do the right thing here. Okay? And by doing that, the universe is going to reward you for not playing games and not messing with people's emotions and for being honest. That universe is gonna re reward you. <sighs> we have the 10 of swords here in reverse. So, um, this is your emotion card. Um, this is a painful, unexpected ending. Regularly, right side up, painful, unexpected ending this way. So this person has betrayed you. Um, whatever is going on in whatever relationship it is, you're feeling a lot of betrayal right now, okay? You're feeling a lot of betrayal. You are going to cut that cord and have a new beginning, okay? You're going to cut that cord and have a new beginning here. You have to make a choice. You know what it already is. There, it's um, the tr You don't have to decide. You know um, cancer is already. You have to follow your heart on this, okay? Follow your heart on this. I'm trying to shuffle the cards here. Oh, look, the Empress. I've had her a lot today. She, this is, this is good. This is a good. You're, you're. Um, I love how she's stepping on the moon over here. Um, you're getting control. Okay, you're gonna be. Um, you're gonna be feeling much more in control. Um, and your resources. Um, you are gonna be rewarded. I don't know resource what resources. I'm just feeling right now that um, something's going to be given to you. You're going to, by making the right decision and following your heart, even though it was really hard, something very good is going to come of this, okay? Resource-wise. Resource-wise. And look at this. See the heart? Follow your heart. It's in there. Make that decision with your heart, okay? Guardian angels, what messages can I give for the final card for my cancers? I know you want them to be alone and in solitude right now. I know you're saying that that's what they need. They need a, a soul break, a spiritual break. They need some rest and relaxation. Okay, um, as your final card, we have Ace of Pentacles. Pentacles is your possession card. Um, and Ace is always new beginnings, right? You have new beginnings in business and finances. See, I knew with this card you were going to be rewarded in, in resources. I felt that. And then look what the final card was, the Ace of Pentacles. So they go hand in hand. This is a good um, outcome. So, um, with this darkness card, um, you see the little rabbit down there staring at that beautiful moon. Um, just know that your decision is going to be tough and, and, um, you're going to make it out of love and not fear. And you see the bright light behind it. Your soul is going to be rested. You're going to be okay with your decision. You're going to be okay moving forward. And, um, I can tell you right now, you control your mind, you control your reality. 
when you control your mind, the universe has your back. Okay? Thank you. We ended it at the right moment, I think. Thanks, Cancers. Let me know how you like it. And please hit the subscribe button um, if it resonates with you. If you don't like it um, or you don't vibe with me, tell a friend. Maybe they will. Thank you.